I'm Jennifer Tipton, a lighting designer for theater here in New York. And I think it was here at the Whitney that I first came to know the work of Edward Hopper and really fell in love with it, both as a lighting designer and just as a person. He uses light in an inexpressible way, in a way that makes you feel something that is very difficult to articulate. The name of this painting is New York Movie. One would think that the light from the screen would be the primary source, but it hardly uh, seems to light the faces even. That light seems to come from this side and not be the same color as the light on the screen. Instead, Hopper directs us to the offstage scene, if you would, the usher waiting for patrons. The uh, light is very cold on that side of the painting, even though there are red shades and red curtains. Quite a feeling of isolation. Conference at night depicts a situation that's totally unrealistic. I mean, there seems to be no source of light in the room itself. The light comes entirely from the window. I can't figure out what that source could be that is so bright that it would light through two windows like that and not be the sun. It feels scary, very bleak, empty. Route 6 Eastham. It seems, it feels just like a, a nice landscape, but it, it's hard to figure out well, you see the angle of light that comes like that. All right, that lights the house. But it also lights and makes this shadow in the road. It's not the same sun at all. And therefore, it's very hard to tell the time of day. Not only is it difficult to know the time of day, it's difficult to know the time of the year. My first impulse was to say summer. And yet this looks like spring in the uh, light-colored green of the, the grass. This looks like fall with color, and it's hard whether this is the color of the sun or that the tree itself is changing color. It's very strange indeed.